We're talking about taking the game one after the other and doing it again still. Can you tell us how you cope with the pressure? We know when it comes to Nigeria, if you do not win, even if you draw, it seemed or is deemed as a loss. Yeah, for me, um, like you said, I'm one of the longest serving, so there is no pressure that I haven't seen you know, playing for the Super Eagles, but I know it comes uh, from a place of love, you know, it comes from a place of passion because I've also been on the other side where I support the team 100%, I go to stadiums to watch the game, so for me, um, I know when we start to win, all the fans are going to come behind us, you know, and uh, I hope we can consistently um, give them that win so we can once again have um, the kind of crowd we had um, when we played Ghana in, in Abuja, you know. Well, I spoke to you after the game and you spoke about giving the credit of victory to the court because of a good change in tactics. Now, looking at the next game which is approaching, do you think that the mindset of the team is happy with the performance you had in the last game against Ivy Coast? Yes, definitely, because uh, it wasn't an easy game. Um, uh, the team needed this win to be able to boost uh, our confidence as well, So, and it has happened. And now I don't think there is anything stopping us from going all out you know, in the next game. Well, on a lighter note, um, so many people have spoken about the weather already. I know it's hot. Um, coming to Ivy Coast, you've been at so many African Cup of Nations. Looking at the weather, is this something that some people would have said, oh, it could affect the play? Um, if every game was at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, then yes, because that first game was really, really hot. Even sitting at the bench, you, you sweat a lot like you're in the game, you know. So games at 6, I think, is, is uh, better. And uh, in a, uh, it's still hot, but, you know, we're Africans and we can... We can handle it. Now, only a few players in the last 10 years, only a few players, Abu Traika, Hussam Hassan, have won the AFCON more than twice. What's the meaning the AFCON, winning the AFCON again mean to you as a player? As a player, it means a lot. Um, it means a lot. But for me, mostly, it's for the younger ones to, to win it. You know, I think it's more important for them to actually win win the AFCON. For me, I've won it. Okay, I've won the AFCON. Even if I won an, win another one, I've won the AFCON. You get. But these um, younger players, they put in a lot of efforts. They, they are amazing, so they deserve to win. All right, um, Francis, Nigeria is having a good tournament right now. Talk to us about the feeling. The feeling for you, the feeling in the camp. How is it like? The, 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 camp, is, the camp is lively, you know. Um, uh, we, we, we believe in ourselves, we believe in our, in our coaching crew, you know, and uh, everybody's been hopeful and positive that uh, we're going to go, we're going to go real far and, uh, and achieve our, our goals. All right, how far do you think we can go in this nation's cup? I think we can go very far, we can go, we can go as much as we can, you know. Uh, we have the, the capability, we have the ability, we have the, the mental uh, toughness, so Hopefully we get to, to, to where we all want to be. Do you, do you, does the team really believe that we can win this nation's cup? Of course, uh, we do believe. We do believe. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be telling lies if I say that we do not believe. Because firstly, you have to believe in yourself. So we do believe that we can, we can achieve uh, this African Cup. And hopefully we, we, we do it. How would you approach the game against Guinea Bissau? Because right now Nigeria is no more desperate to win. The draw is enough to qualify us, and we can actually win at top the group. Would you be slowing down, resting some players, or do you think they're going to go all out? We go to play with our, our best team. Of course, I can change some players because I um, can feel some players more tired if he can recover or not. The first team go to play against Guinea. I believe we will be the best team for that match, for that match, uh, because you need to manage now. We have more two days for manage and see and check if the players are recovered or not. 
because you play too much Guinea Bissau rest five four days, or you rest three days in the first match and second match. And now you have less time for cover, you need to check, but you go for win this match. You want to fight for first position. You fight in this moment with the Guinea Equatorial and um, Cote d'Ivoire, but you want to, to finalize the group in the first position. You go to do the maximum for reach that position. All right, okay? one sentence, one sentence. You said Nigeria would always win the AFCO. You said it from the get-go. You Tell think, me. you've always said Nigeria will win AFCO. Since the first moment, and I signed the contract, and I signed the contract. And this is stand by it. Yes, but I know, okay, but if I, and I signed the contract, I signed the contract until final AFCO. He said, I want to win. Never I can say no, 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 or protection myself. Of course, should be better I protection myself. Don't create expectations. Because if you don't win, it's worse for me, or not. It's worse for me. But I have much enough age for check that and suffer the consequence if you don't do it. But you want to win. And you put my money in my players. You can win. You want to win. It's easy. No. Very good teams. Yes, I say. Marrocos, Senegal, Cote d'Ivoire, Egypt, uh, Argelia, Tunisia, Ghana, Guinea Equatorial, Mali. I don't know if I've Egypt, Nigeria, of course. I don't know if I forgot someone. Many teams, even Cap Verde, play very well in this moment. There are favorites, candidates, and outsiders. Okay, but if I, since the first moment I say I want to win, and now I hide from that objective, no, it's my responsibility. Should be better, I say, nah, I go to play much too much. Of course, you go to play much too much. You need to beat Guinea Bissau. In this moment, you want a good way. If you don't beat Guinea-Bissau, you change our way in confidence and in, cap in the, 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 that uh, that for this feeling for you to it. But okay, I need co my players. Co I convince them. Uh, the key point: I need the lucky, and I need to do our best every time.